Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to Ark Survival Evolved. Is it this one? No. Eh, close enough. Uh, in this episode, we're taming up some really buffed up trikes. So, I'm going to whip out the tap tape jar. Uh, and the hyenodon trap we made in the last episode managed to catch itself a freaking 145 female trike. I've been looking... So, yeah, this one spawned, like, right over there. It's just been wandering around for the last couple days. Uh, so... Everybody's on passive. With the Valyrian Reigns, we can whip out our gun while here. Uh, they have a lot. Of, all of the trike stats are increased by 50%. Are you gonna... Yeah. Is... Oh, yep. It's gonna start destroying the wood. That's okay. Uh, where was I going with this? Uh, all of its stats are increased by 50%. Like, even the damage. Uh, but it also means it'll be 50% uh, more topor. And it requires superior kibble to tame instead of the normal regular, I think it is. Uh, so it's going to take a long time to tame. So that's why I want to get this one out of the way. Here's a 145 female. Actually, while I was running around in the last episode leveling up one of my griffins, I came across a 150 male. And that's what uh, spurred me on to this episode. Are you broken out yet? But man, this, this tape jar is making this super freaking easy. And until it breaks out of the... Uh, wood box, you know. Oh, it's down. That actually didn't take too long. And it didn't even break out of the box. Uh, let's get the Packy Rhino. I uh, speed this thing up. The, the topor should go down really slow because it's still a trick at the end of the day. Oh, I heard combat music for a sec. What are you? Leech blood. Nice. Are you, are you, you're a guy. You shouldn't be bleeding out from there. Uh, let's see. Put you in there. You in there. Uh, Packy Rhino. Let's hop up on the Urgy. And get to work. Check out these stats, alright? 3,000 health. 755 weight. Like, they're uh, increased by 50% over normal. Uh, I forgot the kibble back at home, but let's... I'm stuck. I'm st Alright. Throw down the Packy Rhino. What do I... Uh, let's do right click is food drain. Pop on here. Come on, stop stop munching. Get to work. Alrighty. Uh, I'm going to go get some of the extraordinary kibble. I think we're also going to... Tame up some low-level Utyrannus today, just so we can start getting a constant supply of exceptional kibble eggs. Uh, how many? How much have you produced? Ah, one. Well, that's quite a bit. But it'll be good to have more in the future because the uh, Winter Wonderland event's almost over, so I don't want to run out. Right over here, well, oh, right in my hand. Nope. Oh, there's the 150 male trek I was talking about. Really nice colors. Just gotta get rid of these bugs. Uh, Raptor Claws has gifted me with a crap ton of just uh, wood dino gates. So I don't know if this is gonna work or not. But I'm just gonna plop a couple down. Actually, come on, let's get out of here. Uh, yeah, one more won't hurt. I know it can destroy wood, but like I have so many of these stupid things. Uh, let's put eight down here. Make you manual. Switch to manual. Uh, do you think I can... Oh, hey, there's a Dillo. You're going to ruin my day, aren't you, pal? All right, let's see how this works. I hope that one doesn't get angry. I shot it in the butt. Come on. Ah, oh, of course that one gets angry. Bugger off. Well, I guess the, the trap is working a little bit. It's just too busy attacking the freaking door. Buddy, I'm over here shooting you in the butt. And it's down. Alrighty. So, it destroyed one door frame and then immediately moved on to trying to destroy the next one. Uh, I knocked the other one down. It disappeared? Alrighty then, I'm gonna go get back, get the Packy Rhino, and uh, tame these two up. Oh, the first trike's already tamed up. Oh, and you still have a bunch of kibble left on you. Let's check out your stats. Oop, accidentally hit the door. 
And your stats are... 34 points in the health, 35 in a melee. The weight's a little crappy though, and the stam is. Hopefully the male can make up for those stats, because I want to breed them together before I do what I want to do with them. Actually, those are the levels. The stats themselves are pretty good, like over 4,000 health, 20,000 food. Goodness gracious. I have a, yeah. I'll, I'll, sh I'll show you how good these things are. Well, that sure was fast. Let's check out how you're doing, pal. Uh, five. And the stats are crappy health, 46 in the melee. I, like I said, makes up for what the female makes up for the, uh, blah, 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 blah. yeah, exactly. Good wording, legendary. I'm so proud of you. Uh, I gotta be kind of almost brief with uh, what I record because my computer is down to only like 40 gigabytes of storage. Yeah, I gotta clean some stuff up. If you haven't noticed, trikes are just a little bit bigger with Kraken's better dinos. Uh, they're 30% bigger. Uh, and they have 50% more stats. I think that's how it goes. Yeah, okay, they're getting their groove on now. While they're getting their groove on, uh, Kraken's better dinos adds in the trike platform saddle, which is, I'm super excited about it. Um, I don't know if I have a blueprint for it. Let's see over here. Try... No, I do not. I guess we're going to have to make the old-fashioned way. The platform saddle itself is actually pretty cheap. Only 15 cementing paste, 55 metal ingots, 25 silica pearls, and 250 hide and 190 fiber. That's that's pretty cheap for a saddle. Uh, the extension is a little bit more, but I believe it's what adds the snap points just like the Bronto one. So how, how, how's your groove getting on, everybody? 70%? Alrighty. Well, it looks like we got twins and the mu and a mutation, and the mutation is an oxygen mutation. Uh, I don't think I'm going to keep these ones. Oh, that is some bright pink. Yeah, and they'll both look the same. Hello, stubby little f ladies. You're the size of an item bag. No freaking way. I got triplets right after I got those twins, and they're all the the good level one. Like, this is the max level of all the good stats combined. So it comes out at 247, which is pretty darn nice if you ask me. Uh, let's plop all of you. Where <laughs> There's nowhere else for them to fit. Uh, six, seven, eight. Hello everybody, how you doing today? I like the color. Maybe we can get a mutation on the frill. That'll be nice. But I'm gonna let uh, these, what are they all? Ladies? I'll let them grow up. And uh, I'll show you something cool. Alrighty, really quick. Found it at 150 Arca. Now the real question is, can I hit it? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Was that just someone attacking me? Uh, they tame using chitin, but I have a crap ton of extraordinary kibble on me, so I'm just going to plop a couple in. Really? Come on. There we go, it's out, alright. Uh, I think it'll only take two. Gotta stand on guard, because a bunch of bad hombres around here. You gonna eat up anytime soon, pal? Oh, it only used one. Alrighty. Give me that back. Now, Arcas are really cool with Kraken's better dinos. Pick them up, and they sit on your shoulder, not in your hands. So you can still do whatever you want while you're gliding around. I freaking love them. They're so cool. But uh, good luck Good luck trying to hit the ground. You just press R and it drops you. There we go. We have a new shoulder friend. I wasn't going to do this. So I've been. So there's a reason why my spyglass is on the second slot. I use it a lot. And check out this. 
It's a 150 cast droides, and can I pick it up with the griffin? Because the griffin... Alright, yes, I'm going to bring both these guys home, and I'm going to tame up that uh, cast droides. I've been looking for more reindeer, but uh, I was a little not with it last night, so I think I'm cutting out a lot of that content, and you probably still hear it in my voice right now. Uh, make sure no thylas jump out at me. But, uh, yeah, I just thought uh, I came to pull in 30 reindeer if I didn't show that already. It's hard to tell the difference between female Megaloceros and me and uh, female rain well, any sort of reindeer, because I think they have the same model. Uh, oh well. When I picked it up, it looked awfully, like, black and red, but now it looks more green than anything. Uh, too bad I didn't bring my Packy Rhino with me because I'm going to need a, just a couple narcotics. Alright, just gotta... Oh yeah, you can't get headshots on, on them. Alrighty, it's down. Oh, pink tail. Wow, you, do, you look a lot different from when I first picked you up. Uh, it'll be in need. Just give me a moment, pretty please. Four kibble and 16 narcotics. So time to pump in a lot more than I than I need. Do I have any narcotics in here? No. Okay, I can make a couple. Uh, I'll show you the Arca stat. Arca right here. Uh, 42 in the melee, but it's not really a fighter. So I need more like health and weight. I think yeah just to show you guys how long I've been hunting for I'm up to level 88 halfway to level 89 uh, I forget the last time I, sh I checked in with you guys but it was like level 80 what I think level 86 or something and we're almost to the industrial cooker and here are the stats for that uh, reindeer nothing too special I I'm looking for something preferably a one above 130 but you know I'm gonna take what I can get there we go. I, I pumped in a little bit of extra narcotics just to be safe. Let's check out your stats. Oh yeah, and if I didn't address it already, uh, I'm on Ragnarok looking for high level uh, reindeer because I looked for hours. Um, 38 stam. Ugh, not very good. All nope, not very good. Into the box with you. But they can do one cool thing: is they'll automatically harvest when they're nearby trees, and you can just put them on one. Oh, that's a lot of wood. Well, well, well. It's ugly and yellow, but that's a direwolf. I can I? Yep, I got it. All right, home time. Ah, here's what I wanted to show you: a 145 Rex. Look at those colors. Ooh, is it? Okay, yeah, I think it can handle itself. It'll take a long time to tame, so that's why I don't want to do that right now. But let me get it out of render distance. And there's one more thing: it should be right up along here. The wolf's almost... I gotta go put some meat in the wolf. Uh, right up here is a... Ah, right here. A 180 tech stegosaur. And I believe 180 is the max level for tech dinos. So I'm gonna tame up that in a minute too. Hello, new friend. Let's check out your stats. It's a female, so it'll be easy to breed into the stats. 41 in the melee. That's pretty good. That's, that looks about, that, that's its best stat. All right, I'll, I guess I'll take it. Everybody, I'd like you to meet Camilla. This is going to be Cole's wife. Uh, so I've been running around looking for the reindeer. I think this is going to be the trike episode. But so far I found uh, three 150 direwolves. This 150 moss chops, a 150 spino, a stego, a 180 tech stego, the 145 Rex, uh, 150 UD. Uh, so yeah, I am uh, having lots of luck with everything except for reindeer. So it wanted some raw prime fish meat and some cooked uh, prime meat. So expensive taste. Oh, name. Uh, options, change names. It goes is it C A M I L L A. Mom thinks moss chops are cute. So uh, yeah, she'll have to name this one. Now let's check out your stats. Uh, 40 points in the melee damage, 44 into speed, uh, eh, mid, but now we have a breeding pair of moss chops, so that's nice, they'll really, they're really good at collecting stuff, 
Uh, now, I think I might drag over the 150 dire wolves and put them in here and tame them up. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Why did you take so much damage? What? That's weird. Look at this little puppy. It's another 150. This one's a male. I'm going to try using some of the trank darts that I, I mean, trank arrows that I just picked up from uh, killing stuff. Come on, stand still for a second, please. I don't know if it's going to kill it or not, but uh, better to save my darts for something that needs them, you know? Oh, that's a lot of damage. I need to just stop using the spyglass. Okay, you stay there. Don't die. Ugh. I just want to tame everything. Uh, I was just following raptor claws out here, and there's a death worm. Uh, you know what? I'm going to kill it. If I can. Okay, I'm going to have to do some swoopy, swoopy action. I did it! I did it! Alright, nothing around wants to kill me. Let's check under the ground. Nothing. Alright, let's check out the loot. Uh. Gun? Alrighty. Uh, I forget what they drop. Do they drop a bunch of keratin? I'll take that. A bunch of keratin. Jesus, Pete. I thought they dropped leech, more leech blood. Uh. Any hoozle in with you. Still no luck on that uh, freaking reindeer. Oh, this sucks. Guess who went and found another 150 dire wolf, but the other one woke up before I came back. Yay. This is a real dog pile. <laughs> Doggy time. Hello. I really like the color on this one. Uh, in the... Outside, I thought it was all silver, but the purple is okay. So let's check out your stats. I'm going to zoop up you, and I'm going to zoop up you. And let's see how you're looking. Uh, 35 in the health, 33 in the melee, 41 in the oxygen. <sighs> and you are... Wow. It's... I'm not having very good luck with wolves, am I? I'm going to tame you. If you can just line up your head pretty, please. I freaking scorpion just attacked it. How's your t uh, taming efficiency? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to let it wake up now. Ugh. You know what? I'm gonna tame you too, you son of a gun. It's getting pretty bloody. I'm getting a little nervous. And I think I'm gonna just force feed stimulant into the stegosaur so it wakes back up so I can knock it back out again. But maybe next time I'll actually build a trap. Are you going to go down, ma'am? There we go. Alrighty, how's the area? Surprisingly clear. I don't think anything will attack our Rex. Let's check out your stats super quick. Eh. Wow, level 90 is a big deal. Um, How about... More into weight. At level 90, we're getting pheromone darts, a bunch of tech stuff. All right. Oh, and we can get the industrial cooker too for the next episode. Yeah, that goes to show how long I've been working on this episode for. Hey, Rex time. How's it going? Let's check out your stats. I love the colors. That's why I decided on this one instead of like, I found a couple 145s, but this one stood out. Uh, your stats are... Mid, I guess. Yeah, pretty average across the board. Alrighty, chronologically, this takes place at the end of the episode. So, let's just show off the trike platform saddle. So, plop it on you. This is one of my imprinted ones, right? How do you... It's wooden. It's a raft. Alrighty, I'm digging it. I thought it was going to be metal. You can walk right through the mesh on this side. 
Like, I guess so. How are your stats looking anyways? This one's an imprinted one. Let's give it a whirl. So, uh, with Cracked Vetter Dinos, you take reflection damage like on a Kentrosaur, but with the uh, Trike's Frill. Uh, right click. Charging up. Okay, yeah, you see the Rage Meter on the right side. And that comes up, and then you let her rip. Ooh, that's some good thatch. And it stops when you hit something. Alrighty. I, I kind of wanted to get a trick for thatch in the first place, so that's why I went for this. Uh, I should do more damage the higher the weight of a target, so, like, it'll do... Whoa. 450. Okay, we gotta find something bigger to try this on. You know what? I'm, I'm gonna be a goofy goober, and let's put all the points into speed. For this one. Yeah, it's pretty slow. Oh, yeah, the uh, snappy part. How do you look? Alrighty. Can I... Interesting. So, basically, you gotta make it out of wood. Uh, I'll, I'll see if I can build something on here. Hello, my test subject. How much damage am I gonna do to you? Let's charge it up all the way this time, though. And it stuns? Alrighty. I like it. I like it a lot. Wait, just a normal attack does almost 300 damage? Am I, am I, am I reading that right? Oh, mama, that's, uh, that's pretty good. Hey, Trodon. Hey, Trodon, hey. Yeah, see, so Trodons have not a lot of drag weight, and I didn't charge it up all the way, so that's why that did so little. Wow, trikes are freaking awesome. So just looking at it, behind the saddle looks about to be a uh, foundation's worth of space, which isn't a lot, but, like, you could totally build up this up. I'm going to see what I can do. So, the, um, ceiling snaps right to the snappy part of the saddle. I wonder how big I hit. So, I have the structure limits, like, increased, and I have, I have all the settings. Excuse me, what? That was weird. Well, it does not like being built on. Alrighty. What an adorable little house. I love it. Just open it up. Little bed inside. Got my windows you can look out of. And you could totally shoot from up here. Station it like a tank. This is just a little test build to see what it's like. Uh, in the future, I want to build a taco truck and a tank on a trike. I just realized all the T's. I'm going with it. Oh, that's so cool. I got to take a cool thumbnail. Thumbnail moment. And with that, thank you everybody so much for watching. Next stop, Valguero. I'll see you in the next one. Bye bye.